During his time as chairman, he saw the society changing from a small inward looking group to the dynamic club that it is today. He oversaw changes in competitions in black and white photography to color prints and then to slides and finally to digital images. He was instrumental in the society obtaining its premises at Wellington Front in 1986 and through working closely with the Ministry of Culture, having the status of photography becoming increasingly accepted as an art form. At the same time, he worked full out at maintaining the success of the society and the well-being of its members, hardly ever missing one of the weekly meetings in all this time. 